Three years after Bayfest died, its successor, 1065, is going strong. The free weekend music festival in downtown Mobile opened tonight. News 5's Alan Carter was in in the heart of the fun. Well, not too bad when your assignment's to come out and listen to music, but hundreds with me as 1065 gets underway. Dolphin Street turned into a concert hall. The first day of 1065, Mobile's free and now growing music festival. I think it's pretty cool. It's third year. I've uh, been here every, every day, every year. In a matter of minutes, music fans packed the front of the stage, dancing in the streets. We're just sitting here talking about, we love to people watch, and it feels kind of like Mardi Gras down here without the parades and without that hassle, and it's good. It'll be three days of music over the weekend, multiple acts on multiple stages, all at the same time. I love the person, yeah. like, I mean, it was easy to get here today. Everything seemed pretty organized. I just hope that uh, it keeps going every year. Mobile welcomes the spotlight for an event that's now drawing its own following. I think it uh, helps the art and music community. So, I mean, we have a rich history of that, and it's good to show off that. Businesses downtown also happy for all 1065 brings this weekend. I think that's just a wonderful festival for everyone downtown. Um, the PVs and everybody involved have, put, have really put on something great. Uh, to have a free festival with the bands of this caliber, uh, I think it's great for businesses uh, everywhere down here. Well, the music picks back up tomorrow around 2 with the headlining act, Cage the Elephant, taking the stage around 8.30. Reporting in Mobile, Alan Carter, News 5.